Oksana Malaya began her life living with dogs. Rejected by her mother and father, she somehow survived for six years, living wild, before being taken into care. There are few cases of feral children who have been able to fully compensate for the neglect they suffered. Oksana is now 22, but her future still hangs in the balance. Have scientists learned enough from previous cases to rehabilitate her? For six years, Oksana Malaya spent her life living in a kennel with dogs. Totally abandoned by her mother and father, she was discovered behaving more like an animal than a human child. For two centuries, wild children have been the objects of fascinating study. Raised without love or social interaction, wild or feral children pose the question, what is it that makes us human? Since Oksana's discovery, scientists have looked for clues in the handful of other recorded cases of feral children in their efforts to rehabilitate her. She's made astonishing progress in ways that many thought impossible. And now, age 22, Oksana wants to take an extraordinary final step to be reunited with the parents who neglected her. I want to see them with my own eyes so desperately because I've been told I have no parents. But actually, I do have them. One of the central questions in all of science uh, that, that has to do with humans is are we a product of our genes or are we a product of our experience, the old nature-nurture issue. Feral children tap into this because they are the natural experiment that we're not allowed to carry out. Part of being a human is being brought up by humans. If you're not brought up by humans, are you completely human?